The London School started in 1899 as the London School of Tropical Medicine. And so the school has been on this site since the 1920s. Over its whole existence, over more than 100 years, it's graduated around 70,000 students. It's truly a global institution. Our students come from over 100 countries. We have about 100 projects going on at any one time. Our staff are also very multinational. Uh, and our whole perspective is, is of, a, of a global institution transcending uh, national boundaries. Nimli and London School have been working together uh, for the last 20 years and the focus has been uh, working together in carrying out of research activities here in Mwanza but also uh, in developing the relevant capacities to be able to do research. We benefited from working uh, with the London School from their experience and expertise in areas where we are not capable uh, of doing it ourselves. This is a very uh, collaborative project. Research projects are developed jointly with researchers from the uh, Tanzanian institution at the National Institute for Medical Research and also at London. Um, and it's not only the research, but the program also is uh, focused on training, capacity building. So, so it's really implementing research, but in the context of building uh, long-term and sustainable capacity in Tanzania for research and training. We are doing a clinical trial here, which is aiming in doing a research on clients of age 10 up to 25. They are trying to do a clinical trial, giving a vaccine, and uh, the vaccine they are aiming on targeting on human papilloma virus. We have two projects, one for non-severe malaria that is conducted the outpatient and another for the severe illness is conducted in this ward. The study in this ward is uh, with severe illness. We have one that is a clinical trial looking at improving treatment for severe malaria and the other is a fever surveillance looking at the burden of invasive bacterial diseases. The Gates Award is a tremendous boost to the school, uh, a boost to the, the staff, to the students, to the alumni, because I think it's uh, really a recognition, an external recognition uh, of the, the quality, relevance and importance of the kind of work that we do, both in postgraduate education and research. But additionally, of course, we do a lot of work to try and influence policy and practice. The money obviously uh, is important to us because it will provide an opportunity for us to invest, um, particularly in our distance learning program. The distance learning program has been in existence for about 10 years. It's expanded enormously, and it's become now uh, a flagship program of the school. Now, the reason why we standardised the mortality rates... We've just seen an exponential rise in the demand for our kind of courses that we've not been able to fulfil by the provision that we have here in London, and the distance learning program has been fantastic for enabling us to reach a much greater number of students. We have more students studying by distance learning than we have here in London. I have a diploma in clinical medicine, which is given in third world countries, I think. Not all, but few. And that's because of the shortages of the doctors which our country is facing. It's like a, I got a great opportunity because you know, studying abroad or even getting a chance here in Mwanza, there is no such a college which can give such a education which I'm gaining via the distance learning in London. And what we intend to do is to use some of the money to further develop the program, to update it, but also to add new teaching materials, 
to develop new courses. We also plan to have um, some scholarships for students, particularly from uh, low-income countries, to support them to participate in the distance learning program. For the students, what they learn, they can actually uh, uh, practice immediately after the, the, the training, you, which is different to when you go to an institution and stay there for one year or two years and then come back. With the distance learning, um, I'm expecting to get the qualification that I want. That means Master of Science in Epidemiology. That will help me to perform my duties here. There is a huge burden of disease in developing countries, Tanzania is included. And I'm a Tanzanian, I think my qualification will help me to help my country. I feel excited because I see that even with problems uh, in, in, in less developed countries, uh, it's possible to do great scientific work and, um, and to have a, a very productive collaboration on an equal basis uh, between the other institutions. Uh, I feel very proud of what has been achieved here. I mean, the fact, though, that we've had these long-term relationships, I think, means that um, uh, hopefully our partners do see us as responding in a genuine way to their priorities. And I think it's this combination, really, of uh, a teaching, education, and our interest in policy and practice, which will carry forward for the future.